this is Tomlin from TomlinHarmonicaLessons.com and today I'm going to show you how to play uh, the intro and first verse of Taj Mahal's tune She Caught the Kady. Um, so for this lesson you'll need an E flat harmonica. We're playing in second position in the key of B flat and um, this is a, a really good kind of example of a harmonica playing with a vocalist. So it's not a harmonica solo, you're doing call and response around a vocalist. So before I show you how to do it, let's listen to what it sounds like. Okay, so lick one um, is before the singing starts. It's the intro lick, and it's going to start two bars into the track. And it's going to sound like this one, two, three, four. Okay, so we are starting with a sixth blow that you're going to hold for three and a half beats and then you're going to go to a five blow on the offbeat just after beat four, so that's... And then the next section is a series of eighth notes starting on the offbeat after beat one. So we have four draw followed by a three draw with a little inflection, so you're going to say kia and then a three draw whole step bend, then a two draw, then a two draw whole step bend, two draw, two draw. So that's. Okay. And then the final chunk starts on beat three of the next bar. So it'll be one, two. So you're doing two eighth notes on beat three, four blow, four blow then a little half beat rest, and then a three draw with a little inflection again on the off beat. Okay, so that's one, two. Okay, if we put it all together, it's gonna to sound like this. One, two, three, four. Okay, let's try that together nice and slowly. One, two, three, four. Okay, excellent. So I'm going to go through all, the, all of these licks quite quickly because you can pause the video and work on any that you want to work on. So next lick is going to be during the verse and it's going to be played after the first vocal line. So that'll be the She caught the Katie and left me a mule to ride. Okay, so we'll break it into two chunks. The first chunk sounds like this, one. Okay, and that starts on the offbeat. Um, it's a series of eighth notes starting four draw, you're sliding up, then three draw whole step bend, three draw, two draw, three draw whole step bend, two draw, three draw with a little inflection. So that's... Okay, let's try that together. One, two, three, four, one. Okay, and then the second half of the lick sounds like this. One. 
Okay, so we're starting on the offbeat after beat one. We're doing a quick one draw, two blow. That's 16th notes. And then you've got a little triplet. Two draw, three draw, whole step bend, two draw. And then a series of eighth notes. Two draw, three draw with a little inflection. One draw, then two blow. And then finally, on beat one of the next bar, you're going to do a tongue slap on the sixth blow. Okay, so that whole second half sounds like this. One. Okay, let's try putting those two together, remembering that the whole lick starts on the offbeat after beat one. So one, two, three, four, one. Right, now, next lick, uh, after the next line, uh, which comes after the next vocal line, uh, sounds like this, one. Okay, so, starting on the offbeat, after beat one, we got the little quick 16th notes, two draw, three draw, whole step bend, then a two draw landing on beat two, one. Okay, and then you've got a whole beat's rest, which means that our next bit of the lick is going to start on the offbeat after beat three, and that'll be... So that's the same kind of 16th note, three draw, three draw, whole step bend. And we're doing the three draw with a little inflection, then switching to eighth notes, two draw, three draw with an inflection. Okay, and then we're keeping going with the eighth notes, One draw, one draw, three draw, three draw, whole step bend, two draw. So that second half of the lick. Okay, now the whole lick is gonna sound like this. I'll play it nice and slowly, you can have a listen. So, one. Okay, let's try that together. One, two, three, four, one. All right, so let's move on to lick number three. Okay, so this lick happens at the end of the verse. Uh, so we've got quite a few vocal lines um, before it, rather than the vocal line, harmonica line, vocal line, harmonica line of the first two licks. Um, and it's going to sound like this. So, one. Okay, so we're starting on the offbeat after beat one. We're sliding up to a four draw, and then we're going to do a series of eighth notes. Three draw, whole step bend, bend, three draw, two draw, two draw. And then we're going to play the two draw again on the next offbeat after a little rest, and then again on the next offbeat after a little rest. So that's... So get that nice offbeat feel, kind of cool. And then the final part of the lick starts after beat three. One, two, three. And that's just eighth notes, three draw, one draw, two blow, Two draw with a little inflection. One, two, three. Okay, and if we put both halves of that lick together, it'll sound like this. One, two, three, four, one. Okay, so let's try it together nice and slowly. One, two, three. Okay, excellent. So, if you're feeling feisty, let's try playing uh, with the vocals and uh, fit the licks into the call and response part together. Sheep called the cake. 
lady and left me a mule to ride. She called the Katie and left me a mule to ride. Oh, my baby called the Katie, left me a mule to ride. The train pulled out and I swung on behind. I'm crazy about her. That hard-headed woman of mine Okay, excellent work. So I think, I think it's useful to learn this kind of thing, not necessarily to play those licks when you play She Caught the Katie, but you can, but just to, to learn how to play nice little licks that complement a vocal line and getting used to playing in the spaces in between vocals. So you'll notice that there's barely any overlap between vocal and harmonica, and that's really, really cool. Um, in fact, you could pretty much play the harmonica part and sing the vocal part, and you wouldn't have to do anything too clever to be able to fit it all in. So, do that. If you want me to do some lessons on the rest of the tune, write a little comment below this video, uh, and I'll be happy to do that, because the rest of the tune is pretty cool as well. And uh, if you want to get the tabs and the audio clips, all you need to do is click on the link in the description below, uh, and you'll also be able to download the backing track to play along with, and that'll be fun. And before you do that, if you've enjoyed this lesson, please give me a thumbs up by hitting the like button below. And if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe now, because I put out a new harmonica lesson every single week, and I wouldn't want you to miss out on next week's. All right, happy harping.